Hello, my name is Nakul Kyulogojan, and I'm here to present to you the prototype of my README system. So my README system is an, is an online library system where users can go there to read books, write books, contribute to books, and also send messages to one another. So first of all, in building this application, as I said earlier, I use the rapid application development method to build the system. So I took into consideration the needs of the users and also made sure the system is less costly and done quickly. So now let me send, send you through how my system works. So this is a slash page of my system. So I made it in a way where a new user can join or sign in. And I'm going to demonstrate it, how the user can join for free. So first of all, to join for free, you have to click the join button. Then you sign up with your email, username and password. So after signing up, you click on the sign up button. Then it will send you to the sign in page to put in your credentials. So this is the home page. With the home page, we have the home button. We have the search button, which sends you to the categories of books you can read. We have the library where it tracks your progress, reading progress and the books you've added to the library. And we have the writing center where you can write and publish your books. And we have the notification where you receive notifications and also can send messages through that platform. We also have the profile page. So now let's go through the search page. So with the search page, you can browse different categories of books or search for the book. So now when we go to audiobooks, it will send us to all the audiobooks they have. When we go to history, it will send us to all the books on historical fiction. When we go to mystery, it will give us all the books we have on mystery. So this is the browsing categories. Now let's move on to the library. So with the library, it shows you where you've read up to and the books you've also started reading and the ones you've also added to your library. So when you click on the continue to play, there's an audio book. So when you click on continue to play, it sends you to the page and sends, shows you your progress. So Maybe with episode one of the audiobook you've reached here. So that is it for the audiobooks. And now with the actual books, you can continue to read and it will send you to where you've reached, exactly where you've reached on your book. And you can also leave a comment to the author so that maybe they have something to add to it or if you like the book. So now let's go to the writing page, adding your own story. So the writing page, first of all, you can add a cover, your story title, and give a description on the story, then write your stories. So after you are done writing your story, you can upload your story and it will be Give you a message that your story has been published successfully by readme publications so next we are going to the notification place so this gives you a notification about things going on on your system and you can also go to the messages where you can add a message and send a message to anyone you want then back to the home page you can go to your profile when you go to your profile you can decide to log out or check change your profile go to settings and change your profile delete account or change password then you can also also ask for help and when you ask for help 
it will ask you what help you need with the system. So basically, this is what my system does. Thank you.